everyone and welcome back to my channel physio trends this is me physio prem shah and this is physio quest series 2.0 i'm going to explain you answer to the question number 11 which was asked during this week so let's start without wasting any time the question asked in this week was about a stammer sign right and the full question goes something like that 45 year old woman is there who comes with the symptoms of bilateral extremity swellings. Also for further examination, physiotherapist finds that patient is having pain while palpation. Also easily it is going for bruising and most importantly, stammer sign is negative and we need to find out from the given option which can be the least possible symptom for this condition. So my dear friends, let's understand this question first that this question is actually about bilateral lower extremity swelling in which stammer sign is negative. So now the question is what is stammer sign? Stammer sign is something in which when a therapist tries to palpate or pinch the skin over the dorsum of the foot, therapist is not able to hold the skin and that is always positive in the cases of lymphedema. Here what information given to the question is that it is negative which means this is not the case of lymphedema but this is a case of lipidema. Because patient is having bilateral lower limb squaring plus on palpation there is a pain as well as bruising. So this information is clear from the question. Now we need to identify which option are least available symptoms in this condition. We already know it is a lipidema so we will see which symptoms are not to be seen in this condition. So let's begin with the first option that it says that the distal edema will be less apparent on the foot. Now that makes sense, just now we discussed stemmer sign is negative, so obviously distal edema is less than only the stemmer sign is going to be negative. So this option cannot be correct because this is possible in this scenario. Second option is cellulitis. Now cellulitis is something which will never be possible in the lipidema condition. Whenever the stemmer sign is negative, lipidema is there. So already information is given, given that it is negative. So we can say that this particular thing, cellulitis, cannot be commonly found in this condition. So this option might be correct. But before that, let's see option C and option D as well. Option C says that family history. Now family history in lipidema is common. So again, this option cannot be correct. And option D which says that symmetrical swelling in bilateral lower extremity. So my dear friends, whether it is lipidema, lymphedema, we will see bilateral symmetrical swelling in the both the lower extremities. So this option also cannot be correct. So as discussed before, option B which is cellulitis is not commonly found in this condition and that is why that is going to be the correct answer. I really hope that you have understood the question as well as answer to the question and if you still have any doubts do let me know in the comment section. I will be more than happy to help you all.